Welcome to a Cars Guide preview of the new third generation Peugeot 308 that actually arrived in Europe about 18 months ago and is only now in Australia. That's because of production disruption caused by, you know, a global pandemic. And Peugeot didn't want to de-specify this important new model because of a lack of semiconductors. It's offered in hatch and wagon versions. They're both powered by a 1.2 litre turbo triple, driving the front wheels through an eight-speed auto. A hatch-only plug-in hybrid version will arrive next year, offering more grunt and around 60 kilometres of EV-only driving range. Outside is typically Peugeot sleek and sophisticated. Inside is a screen fest. There's a 10-inch central multimedia screen and a 10-inch configurable digital instrument cluster. The hatch's boot is big, and yes, the wagon's is even bigger. The old model started at about 36k, so we reckon you're looking at about 40 for the combustion car, and 50 plus for the plug-in hybrid. Au revoir.